Oh, definitely. You know, Tyrone. I suppose they're the All Ireland champions. You know, they grind out hard wins and uh, they know how to play football. And I suppose looking at the Kildare game the last day, they, you know, they worked as hard as they could, and it was a real titanic battle. And Kildare really put it up to them. But you know, Tyrone are a good season team, and they knew how to come through it. Like, so it's going to be exactly like that the next day. We surprised they found it that tough against Kildare because Kildare are an up and coming team, obviously. Um, I suppose no, I didn't surprise me at all because Kildare are a good team and you know, Kieran McGinney there is a well-experienced manager now at this stage and um, I suppose he's brought a lot of his arma tactics to the game especially especially to Kildare and you could see it in their play and um, it didn't surprise me at all the way they played and um, I think Tyrone played very well as well and they matched them just as much as well and I think Kildare threw with him Ty- Tyrone gave it back with interest you know would you be worried at all of uh, how comfortable it was for you against Donegal that uh, you know maybe it m- might have been better to get a stronger test going into a game like this? I definitely, you know, I suppose like with 20, 30 minutes to go there, the game was over really being realistic, like, and I suppose a lot of us, even including myself, a lot of us took our foot off the pedal, you know, and it was that can happen as well. But um, look, at the end of the day, the quarter final, there was only eight teams left, and you know, like you only can play what's in front of you, and you know, we're in the semi final, we're in the exact same position as we were last year, and that's where we want to be, you know. How are you finding your own form this year? Obviously, you were playing very well uh, for the first few games, and it was a stronger test, obviously, the last day against Donegal and Michal Murphy. Ah, oh, yeah, definitely. You know, he's a good, he's a good young player, open coming player. You know, he gave it to me, especially last few minutes to go, he gave it to me. Like, but um, look, you take the good and the bad. You know, I suppose all you can do is just go back to the drawing board, I suppose, and put your head down and just see where you went wrong, where you went right, and work on training. And I'm happy enough to be honest. You know, I think I've had a good year. Like, if um, if kind of, I suppose I've just taken one by one, one step at a time, one game at a game. You know. How would you assess the challenge at Tyrone? Uh, geez, they're, they're a savage team. You know, they're all Ireland champions. You know, you've class players there like Mulligan, O'Neill, you know, Sean Kevna, all these type of boys. You know, and they all have all their medals in the back pockets, and they're going for a two-one road, and they're going in for it. You know, they've they haven't previous years there where they won the All Ireland, they've lost the next year, like in the first few rounds, and they didn't make the mistake this year, so they're really up for up for it this year. They really want to go and get the two-one row, so they're a great side. But you know, look. We're a good side too, and you know we're ready too. Like you know, we're ready for it as well. I'd imagine when you uh, made the decision to come back from Australia, things that kind of motivated you to, to take up football again were, you know, playing the All Ireland Champions in Croke Park and All Ireland Semi Final Day. Big time, you know, like last year when I was back when the All Ireland Semi Final was on against Kerry. Like you know, I was on the bench that time, and I to be honest, it was frustrating watching it. Like and you know, I probably put a few goals instead of the start of the year last year, and I said if we can get back, you know, the further every, each the further game, every game Cork is further. Hopefully, being the starting team, you know, being the parade before the game, and be being the starting fifteen. Like so, definitely. And it's Kerry and Mead in the in the other semi final. Are you surprised to see Kerry back in the latter stages of the championship because they didn't look too impressive against you in the replay here? No, it doesn't surprise me one bit at all. Um, I always say that look, Kerry are a class side, you know. Fellas like the Gooch, you know, Declan Sullivan, Paul Galvin, Dara Shea, these fellas are class season campaigners, they know how to win. You know, they probably farm dipped and they probably maybe the call the, the draw was kind to them, I suppose, in a way, but it doesn't surprise me one bit that they're back to where they are and you know, it doesn't surprise me if they get to the dollar and final either.